We need a song for Manoj. Or a chant. Or, or, a, or a, a hurrah. Manoj, 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 Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions. It's up, Corbin. I'm Rick. And Manoj is our dost or dosti. Yeah. He, we, he is the dosti of our dost. Whoa. You sure you don't want to give that to Pankaj? He's the first one to drop dost on us. I know, but I, I think love, he gets some priority there. But I love them all. I do too. And they're both great actors. So. You know what? I got a, I got a message from Niraj. How was he? About what's his acting class that he oh, does. Yeah. I've been getting consistent messages because I've wanted to attend that thing online. Mm -hmm. I was like, wow, well, I got a. Got a message from Niraj Kali saying, hey, the class is starting. Oh no, she sent me a message. When? The picture of your mom. Sweet. Yeah. Is my eye red, by the way, still? A little bit? Uh, barely. If any of you noticed I had a red eye, it's because my mom punched me. <laughs> with her foot. I think that's a kid. Just kidding. It was as happens every once in a while. If you ever get a scratch on your eye from a towel or something, I was playing with Boston. And Herpes. I, I rubbed my eye uh, and I got the, it's chlamydia. Today we're doing a uh, old trailer reaction of Manoj. Manoj. Manoj Bajpayee. This is his film Sul from 1999. Uh, so it's very, very. Are we going to party like it's 1999? I would hope so. Uh, Manoj Bajpayee, uh, Sayaji, uh, Shinde, and Ravina Tandon. Where's Ranveer? We don't react to anything unless Ranveer is in it. Shul, English for the trident, not to be confused with the gum, is an action crime film directed by Ishwar Nibas, written and produced by Ram Gopal Varma. Cool. It portrays the politician criminal nexus and the criminalization of politics in Bihar and its effect on the life of an honest police officer. The climax of the film was entirely shot at the State Legislative Assembly in Hyderabad. The film won the National Film Award for Best Feature Film in Hindi and was screened at the International Film Festival of India and the Toronto International Film Festival. Yeah, so I've heard a lot of, I've actually heard a lot about this when we did do um, our, our interview with, uh, this is one of the ones that I, I wanted to try to watch, but we just didn't have time and we watched some other stuff of his, obviously. Um, but, and also, He's I don't been know. knocking it out of the park, too. We talk a lot about, you know, this being the year of Fahad Fasil. Oh, Manoj, He's done. yeah. Manoj, and he had that freaking great, that song, remember that song thing mm -hmm. he did? Uh, and he's just been coming out with just stellar stuff for Band a long man. time. Uh, yeah. But yeah, so I don't know how the uh, the trailer's going to be. It's 1999, so I don't even know if it's an official trailer. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> time that land forgot. Maybe we'll get some narration here. Here we go. Shumaru. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm not official trailer, can I tell you? But you are not going to be sound sick, isn't it? Two of the Nikia, but you are not going to be able to do it. You are not going to be able to do it. You are not going to be able to do it. You are not going to be able to do it. Heck 
you re them yet. Obviously not the official trailer. No, I but got... I would watch it. I... It's, it's Manoj Bajpai. He, so looked, yeah. he looked great. He looked great. And I love these old trailers that are not the real thing, that are just fan-made. Scenes. I love them. And it also made me think of something else I may want to do. I would love to take trailers that are from anywhere, not in English, and just add my own subtitles of what they're saying. <laughs> I think I'm going to do it. Maybe maybe put it on my channel and just do... Do it. Just, do, just call it my, my stupid trailers and just... Put my own <laughs> translation of what I think they're saying, even though I have no idea. Uh, that'd be funny. Yeah? yeah. I like it. Um, I thought it said it was directed by Ram. I did too. Whoa, wait a minute. Anya Ram okay. wrote it? Probably, because he wrote uh, Satya as well. He wrote everything. Um, everything in Indian cinema was written by Anya Ram Kashyap. Everything good. Am I right, guys? Because he's yeah. our dost. Yeah. Sorry. He's our 420 buddy. <laughs> um, written and produced. Okay, I thought it said directed. Um, so it's written and produced by Rem. Uh, right, and the, the dialogue movie. was on your own. Yeah, who was Satya? Uh, right, that. Um, but Anurag also wrote, or was at least the dialogue of um, Anurag Kashyap. Speaking of producers, there was a bunch of producers. We didn't mention them uh, on uh, the movie we just watched. Yeah, and. Uh, yeah, Karen Trevor. Yeah. Um, so I'm. I know this one is like one of his most renowned performances. So I would see it strictly. Which is even, more renowned, this or Satya? Probably Satya. Yeah. But yeah, the Bombay line. Yeah, Bombay. Yeah. But it's also like culturally, like it it shook it. But in terms yeah. of his performances, I know this is like known as one of his better ones. Um, He's yet to disappoint he, us. I don't. I don't. He could be in like we've said many times. Him. Pankaj, Nawaz, they could be in bad films. Niraj. But like, I don't think they can give a bad performance. Correct. It's like, it would be shocking. Ir Irfan. Yeah. It, um, would be, it would be, it would literally be shocking. Not to be in a yeah. bad film. You know what it would be? It would be Daniel Day Lewis in Nine. It would be one of those things where you're like, oh wow, you actually didn't do well. That doesn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> um, and she, her as well, we've seen uh, in a few things. Ravina. Ravina. Um, what was it? Yeah, you know who she kind of reminds me of at first glance when you look just quickly down at the... She looks like uh, Gloria Stefan in the eyes. A little bit. Gloria Stefan in the Miami, Sam Miami Sam Machine. <gasps> no vas a Apparently he plays a waiter. This is one of his little... I love it. But was it cut like Pankaj in... Uh, oh, oh, probably. So sad. So sad. Why but I love that? all of these little roles that Nawaz had. Nawaz, Pankaj. Coming up yeah. through, yeah, coming up through the, uh, the ranks he, and he, paying his dues. And to become, like, in my opinion, possibly the best actor uh, that I've seen in Indian cinema currently. Um, but that's just, uh, I might be biased. I love that man. I think he's so good. I do too. Uh, but anyways, yeah. How is this film? Should this be one of our next Pankaj? I, not Pankaj. Uh, <laughs> is he in this? Are, uh, you, are you sure Nawaz is your favorite? Because I think your heart is linked with the, the dose. Oh, those two, those two are definitely my... And, and Monoj. Those, like... They're like interchangeable. I think, even though, I think they're both incredibly weird because we saw Nawaz in that Salman Khan film. We played the reporter, and he's extremely hilarious. Uh, so I think Nawaz can easily play comedy, but in terms of just like Pankaj does it all the time, effortlessly. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so my, he might even get the edge, uh, <laughs> just in terms of an all-around actor. But you're picking hairs, then. You really are. <laughs> you really are at that point. Manoj, same thing. He's he could be incredibly funny. We said family. It really just comes down to style. It's like who do you like better? Do you prefer watching Gary Oldman or Tom Hardy? It's like, well, no, both. They have just different films and different qualities, and they're neither one's better than the other because you can't do it any better. Yeah, they really they really are the best yeah. of the best. Anyways, uh, so should this be uh, one of our next one for um, uh, our dosed uh, Manoj? Manoj. And should he come on the channel and review it with us? We should have a watch party with him. We should. That'd be so fun. I love it when actors watch their movies. I wonder if I could get somebody to do that. Have you seen the video of Harrison Ford? I'll see, I'll see if I can. Watching Raiders for the first time? <laughs> if you've never seen it, search on YouTube, Harrison Ford watching Raiders of the Lost Ark. It's so funny because he doesn't watch his movies and he finally watched it after like 35, 40 years. Yeah, that'd be interesting. I'll see if... I, if uh, you have to have a good relationship with somebody in order to be like, 
hey, do you want to watch one of your, your movies? Films? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll see what I can do. Right. Let us know down below. Josh!